scholarship and award celebration hosted by the University of Houston Black Alumni Association. So tell me a little bit about this event tonight. Uh, well, tonight we typically uh, bring together three to four hundred of our African American alumni as well as our corporate supporters of the University of Houston back together again to recognize the achievements of our African American alumni, but also to use the profits that we raised for the night to give uh, thirty-three to forty thousand dollars in scholarship opportunities to African American students at U of H. Okay, and that's the uh, theme. That's connecting the, the past and inspiring the future. Past, inspiring the future. Yes. I see that. Well, good luck with yes. that, Brandon. Thank you. All right. I'm here with Christian. Christian, yes. can you tell us what's your affiliation with the uh, University of Houston Black Alumni Association? I'm currently the vice president this year. Okay. And this, this event tonight, I mean, uh, what can you tell us about it? What's the objective? What's the purpose? Um, our theme this year is bringing back the past and connecting it to the future. So it's really about bringing back our, all of our past honorees, people who have given to the university, and also inspiring our future students to achieve more, to go ahead, to be greater. So now are you heir apparent to the uh, presidency? <laughs> um, we have our annual elections coming up in about a couple of weeks, so we will see how those go. Okay. All right. Thank you a lot, Chris. Thank you very much. All right. Mr. Turner, well, yes, what's sir. your involvement with this uh, event tonight? Look, I graduated from University of Houston. Oh, okay. I graduated from University of Houston in 1977. I uh, was very active in the, in, the, in the Black Student Association back then and I uh, was a speaker of the student, student Senate, man, and, uh, and debated on this college campus for, for, two, for two years. While wow, preparing yourself for politics, Preparing huh? myself for politics, getting ready, majoring in political science, uh, minor in speech. Uh, but some of my best days were on the campus of the University. I'm Charlene Johnson, and we are alumni. And the year that you see on that program, that's the year we were born. Hi, we're here with Mr. and Mrs. Luckett. Mr. and Mrs. Luckett, can you uh, tell us what your expectations are about this event tonight? Well, I'm, I'm really excited uh, being a part of the board of uh, visitors for the University of Houston, also past chairperson for the uh, Black Alumni Galas. I'm really excited about what's happening tonight, especially recognizing over the last 25 years the recognition of all the, the blacks that have come through the University of Houston that have achieved significant accomplishments. And you know, it's really good when we can highlight those types of things to really encourage students to follow, to follow and pursue. So I'm really excited. I look forward to some exciting things tonight. All right. Well, in addition to encouraging the students to pursue, I mean, is there anything you could tell our listeners, audience that would, I guess, encourage them to actually actively get involved? Yes, especially if uh, you're with the University of Houston, uh, you know, if you're a graduate, definitely sign up uh, with the alumni organization. That's the one way that you can really give back. Uh, you know, the University of Houston has given myself and I'm sure those who have graduated so much. And a way to give back is to really get involved, get engaged, and make things happen for those to follow. Thanks. All right. We're looking forward to having a good right. time tonight. Thanks. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right. Chair Stacy Hawkins to the stage. Good evening. Being able to chair the scholarship committee has been a very joyful experience. I want to take a moment to welcome and thank our generous donors like Bracewell and Giuliani and Rashawn and Cicely and McDonald. Hi, we're tonight with the uh, MC. Let you introduce yourself and tell us um, what your role is tonight. 
Hi, my name is Latoya Silman. Um, I graduated from University of Houston in 2001, so I'm very pleased to be here. I'll be the mistress of ceremonies, and I was very honored that they asked me to do it. Right. So what could you tell our listeners audience that would encourage them to also get actively involved? Well, you know, U of H gives so much to us, so why not give back to it? And it's so great to see so many of us who look like us doing so well. I think that's the huge thing to realize that, you know, when you go off into the world, you may be one of only a few in your company. Right. So when you come here, you say, oh, wow, look at all of my um, classmates and my colleagues and, and folks that I went to school with that are doing just as well, if not better. And so you can kind of glean from each other and learn from each other and just see that, wow, we went to a really good school and now it's time to make sure that the next generation has the same success. Connecting the past, inspiring the future, Exactly, right? exactly. All right. Good luck. Well, I'm looking forward to tonight. Thank you. Yeah, me too. Oh, it's going to be great. All right. Yeah, I'm especially looking forward to Carl Thomas. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good luck. Thank you. We have a, yeah, clap for that. Yeah, we're everywhere. Pretty amazing, I guess. First and foremost, I would like to thank the University of Houston's Black Alumni Association for presenting yeah. me with this award. Why don't you tell us, what's your interest in the event tonight? Actually, I am on the board of directors for the University of Houston Black Alumni Association. I'm the chair for communications. So broadcasting the event, all of the social media and marketing, I assisted with making sure that people knew about the event tonight. Oh, good deal. And what could you tell our listening audience that would encourage them to come out and be a part of this in the future? The University of Houston Black Alumni is an awesome organization. Um, it's catered towards the youth and future scholars. So we're here to give back to the students of the University of Houston and allow them to get an education through the scholarships that we give out, as well as helping out in the community. Uh, a lot of the community service uh, events that we do, it's basically just giving back to the community. So I would say if you would like to see the community become more positive and more successful, uh, a lot of students to grow, then I would say that you should be a part of the University of Houston Black Alumni Association or give to the association so that we can become a positive impact in the community. There, you heard it straight from uh, <laughs> it's Jasmine Lynch. Aisha, would you tell us what what are your what's your uh, I guess connection to the event tonight? Sure. Uh, this year, I served as the co-chair of the scholarship committee. We were fortunate enough to give four scholarships in the name of Rashawn and Cicely McDonald, and the scholarship recipients were here tonight to receive recognition for that. So this year, I happen to be the scholarship chair. Oh wow, that's good. When, what can you tell the uh, listening audience that would, uh, I guess, encourage them to come out and get more actively involved? Sure. The Black Alumni has been around for over 25 years, and if you are a student that has ever attended the University of Houston, you are considered an alumni. So only three to six hours of college credit makes you an alumni of the University of Houston. So we always encourage every Cougar, whether you completed a degree here at the university or not, to come back to the university and give back to those that would like to graduate. <laughs> So here we're, we're here with Vicki uh, tonight. Vicki, can you tell us, what's your affiliation with the uh, event that's taking place tonight? Well, actually, I'm a board member with the University of Houston Black Alumni Association, and I've been on the board probably about five years. 
and it's been very rewarding. And whenever they have an event, I try to come out and do the photography, and that's kind of my contribution to them. And also I attend the meetings and uh, contribute in any way I can. Okay, well what could you uh, tell our listening audience that would encourage them to also get actively involved? Um, it's something that you can do that will, it's kind of a fulfillment for yourself that can, uh, you can do to help yourself with the community, but if you graduated from the University of Houston, it's, it just makes you feel a part of it again and it's a way that you can give back. All right, good deal. Well, thanks a lot, Vicki, and uh, continue to give back through photography. My last year in office, but I leave knowing that I made a difference in the lives of African American students on campus. I recently helped a couple of students uh, that graduated this year um, on their resumes and their interviewing skills. Okay, we're uh, getting ready to close it out here at the 25th Annual Scholarship and Award Celebration hosted by the University of Houston Black Alumni Association. We're going to close it out tonight with Carl Thomas.